the morning. Always think up, always think up, always think up. You know what we do. So I'm on this 30-day Love Yourself Live Challenge, right? So first I want to tell you guys, you're great. So I wake up in the morning every day, no matter what happened yesterday. I look in the mirror and I say, I am great. I'm smart. I'm funny. I'm beautiful. I'm passionate. I'm dedicated. I'm motivated. I love my family. I love my life. I love you, Becky, and I miss working with you, right? So that's how I roll it out. What motivates you guys? What motivates you in your life? So, you know, for me, it's my angels. Everybody that I lost, they motivate me. I want to do better because I know that they see me, right? My baby, I want to do better because I want her to know sometimes life's rough, but put a smile on your face because it's so, so worth it, right? Then I go through my, I do yoga in the morning. So my 30 days of self-love, I'm working on my core because I need to give my core a little bit more love. I'm working on eating more foods from the light because I know better. I've just been busy, so I've just been eating some crap. So I woke up this morning. I did some yoga for my core. It was like 10 minutes. Guys, you can fit this stuff in, right? I ate some oatmeal. I took a shower, washed up with tea tree. Then, you know, I get ready for my day. And then I wake my daughter up. And then I go through the I am greats with her. And we look in the mirror together and I say, I am great. And she copies me. I am smart. And she copies me. This is what we do, guys. This is what we do. You're great. Own it. Don't live in the vibrations of your mistakes, man. You're too fucking awesome to do that. That wasn't what we were here for. We weren't here to hold on to our mistakes. We are here to kind of have to forget about them, move on, and be great, right? You don't have to hold on to anything you made a mistake about. If you hurt someone's feelings, send them some love, get over it. If you messed up, send some love, get over it, right? And when you're doing this stuff, guys, so, you know, we plant seeds of intentions that we want. So we throw out this that we want, prayers, right? We throw out all this stuff that we want, and then we get it. But sometimes it's not like exactly how we hoped. And why does that happen? It happens because you get everything you ask for at the vibration that you vibe at, at that current moment. So what does that mean, right? So when I throw out my prayers, when I throw out my prayers, then I have to fall in love with myself in the now. Because when you fall in love with yourself in the now, when your prayers come down and you're vibing up, you just kind of meet right up there, right? That's what happened. So I've been waiting for a call for a couple months. Guess what happened this morning? I got it. Listen, guys, the world is your oyster. You can have anything you want, man. I just want you to know that and be that. Be love. Love yourself. Love everyone around you. If they're not really serving you or making you feel good, send them some love and keep it moving and know that's all right. Please, 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 today, it's Friday, it's about to be the weekend, please know you're great. Please know you're great, feel that you're great, say that you're great, tell somebody else that they're great. You know, I got my coffee today from McDonald's, that's great. I'm excited for my day, um, excited for my weekend. Guys, get excited about life. If you're not sure how to get excited, message me on here, email me thinkupboys at gmail.com. I love you guys, and I just want to know... Um, what you do to be great. So send me some messages. Tag me to some posts about what you do to be great. I love to share this stuff. Hell yeah, you're great, Back, You've been great, man. We've been talking about this for a long time. All right. Well, I freaking love all of you, man. And just know if you're somewhere that you don't want to be, I love you too, Back. You can create greatness right from that space. So just get away from anything that doesn't make you feel good. Go by yourself. Being alone is okay because that's how you learn how to love yourself when you're alone. Um, I have a lot of people messaging me looking for love. That's not what this is about, guys. This isn't a dating website. I love you all dearly. If you're looking for love like that and you're pulling me toward you like that, guess what I know? You need to love yourself. Yeah, be loved. That's all you can be, Nelson. Thank you. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to get my day cracking. I got a lot of really fun stuff planned out for today. It's Friday. It's 22 degrees. I had that heater on blast. My reggae music was turned up. I'm in the islands, man. They don't know me. <clears throat> they don't know me. You know, you can create what you want with your mind. So today, do me a favor. Four times today, you can use social media. It's a great way to do it, right? So <clears throat> I look at beach pictures, mountain pictures, whatever. 30 seconds, four times a day, I look at these pictures and I just remove myself from my current situation and I go there like it's like a vacation, 30 seconds, a minute, boom, I'm done. Try it, guys, I'm telling you. 
there's some really good stuff out here whenever you start loving on yourself, man. It gets better and better and better and better and better. All right, guys, we're all connected. That's why I do this. One love. Mwah.